Hi, and welcome to McDSP Quick Tips, a series of short videos to help you get the most out of your McDSP plugins. This video is all about getting control of your bass tracks with the 6034 Ultimate Multiband. Using multiple tracks to create a sound is a common practice in modern music production. Getting all the elements to gel together can sometimes be a challenge with traditional dynamics processing. Let's see how an expander in the 6034 Ultimate Multiband can help in this regard. Here's a bass part that has four different components. Two electric bass tracks, and two synth bass tracks. When playing them all together, they don't quite meld into a single sound. Engaging the 6034 on the bass subgroup with compression in slots 1 and 2 helps with the body of the sound, but the attack is still getting lost. To make sure the level of the attack portion of the bass is even, let's put the FRGX Expander module in slot 3. We can solo this module to focus in on the attack. Let's start with the threshold and the ratio set to just about halfway. The attack should be set as fast as possible with a fairly slow release. Now, as we bring the range up, the attacks start to even out but still sound natural. To further refine the sound, adjust the threshold to make sure to get all of the attacks. Take the solo off of module 3 to hear the final result. So now that we have everything dialed in, let's go back and listen to the bass part back in the track before the processing. And now after. Again before. And after. Using the expander module to even out the attacks shows how simple it is to use the 6034 Ultimate Multiband to dial in a sound fast and effectively. To learn more about the 6034 Ultimate Multiband and all the other great McDSP plugins, go to www.mcdsp.com. Thanks for watching and stay creative.